Speaking of jobs, a developing story. One of San Diego's biggest employers is about to battle the world's biggest company. The trial is starting over the billion dollar lawsuit between Qualcomm and Apple. That is all happening in a San Diego courtroom and with thousands of San Diegans working for those two companies, the outcome could have an impact on local jobs. At the center of the Apple Qualcomm lawsuit is the technology we use every day, smartphones. The trial is really essentially about the value of a smartphone and who controls that value more. Joshua Sisko is a senior antitrust correspondent for MLEX and is covering the trial. He says a case like this will get complicated fast, but basically it boils down to the modem chips Qualcomm makes that are used in iPhones and how much those chips are worth. Qualcomm makes chips, cellular chips that connect to the internet when you're walking around with your phone, and Qualcomm says that those chips are essentially sort of the, the backbone of the phone. They enable it to, they, they make a smartphone smart. Essentially, Apple says Qualcomm's model of chip selling and patent licensing isn't legal, and the company should have to pay billions in damages. But Qualcomm is firing back, saying Apple and its business partners actually owe the company money. Apple hasn't been paying Qualcomm, and Qualcomm wants billions of dollars in royalties that could end up seven or eight billion dollars or more. In, royal, in, in owed in back paid royalties. Although the outcome of the case could have a big impact on both companies, Cisco says Qualcomm could have more to lose in the long run. If the judge rules in Apple's favor, Qualcomm will have to change its business model and it won't be able to extract the revenue and profits from its licensing program that it currently, that it currently generates. With Qualcomm based here in San Diego employing thousands of people, a legal blow like this could potentially impact operations and possibly jobs. Either way, it's a case being closely watched. There's tens of billions of dollars on, uh, on, on the line for both companies. Now, as far as consumers are concerned, this case could affect how much we pay for iPhones and how fast we see new technology like 5G. The trial is expected to last several weeks. It's going to be a big